Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing this girl. This is Lanessa in TT1BOLBRY by Bobby Boss. Stay tuned. Okay, so um, today I'm gonna be reviewing uh, a wig by Bobby Boss. This is Lanessa, and I have her in TT1B O L B R Y. And what it looks like to me is like an oily berry, which I really hope that's what I got here. I'm getting her out of the package. Oh, she's stuck. Hang on. Okay, so I really hope that that is what I ended up getting. Um, it is. So I, I, there was a wig that was suggested to me to get in an oily color, um, and every time I go online to find this girl, she's sold out, of course, because that's how, you know, things go, right? But, ooh, she's got a sticky tape on the top of her head. But I did manage to find Lanessa, and I thought, you know, she's cute. She's a cute little wig. So I'm going to pick her up in that oil berry oil berry color and see what what that color looks like um so this is what i got now if you're new to my channel welcome and if you're not new you're going to notice that i already have a stocking cap on my head and you can see hair there's hair there because i'm trying to grow out a silly little pixie and i've tried this a couple times before and I just end up shaving it off again because hair. But I'm gonna try to uh, grow out a little bitty pixie at the top and then maybe do some disconnected uh, undercut with it or something like that. I will show y'all if I ever decide to go out of the house without wearing a wig on my head ever again. It's, uh, at this point it's unlikely. Anyway, so here we are. This is Lanessa. Oh, can you see that oily color? She's got all different strands of like purples and blues in there. Can you see that? Oh, Y'all, that is pretty. She, look at that. Gorgeous. I'm very excited about this color. Okay, let's look at this stock card real quick before I get too ahead of myself. This is Lanessa by Bobby Boss. She's a premium synthetic lace front wig. Um, she is heat friendly up to some hundred degrees as Bobby Boss never really puts that on there, but you're probably okay up to 350, but I would test lower than that if I were you, um, until you can reach maximum heat. Okay. She's got a six inch deep lace part. And what else about her? Her stock number is MLF312 Lanessa. Got all that? Okay, I'm excited. She's a Bobby Boss. Now, let's look at her cap construction, and I'm noticing, the first thing I'm noticing is this teeny tiny little parting space. Y'all, it is pencil thin. Can you see that? It is like you could run an ink pen up in there. That is it. So if you do get her, you might want to consider... Um, plucking this one okay she has a hard lace which means she's probably an older unit I don't know how old this unit is but her lace is that hard can you even see it is that hard brown lace it's not the the soft um the softer it's Swiss but it's not I have hair it's not the softer uh, lace. All right, the inside of her cap. Let's see, what do we have? We have two combs in the front. There and there. Okay, we have a comb in the back. Right there. And let's check the inside of her cap. She has open wefts, which means your finger can poke all the way through, and I'm not gonna go that way, but the hole this way, okay? All right. She also has those nifty adjustable straps. 
All right. Okay. So it looks like she is going to be, um, oh, she's going to be a left side part. All right. So let's get her on my head and see what she do. Oh, and I have them on the widest setting. They come that way, but I'm not switching it because I have kind of a big head. lace off and I'll be right back and I'm back okay so um, I cut the lace in the best way I can cut it and that's all I got okay there's not a whole lot of room to work with some of these lace front wigs it is not a 13 by 9 or by 6 or even a 4 by 4 it is a commercially produced lace front wig which means it has a very small amount of lace you can work with so I just and I'm a lazy wig wearer so I just cut it as close to the hair as possible leaving trying to leave a little jagged jagged <laughs> jaggedy edge okay so um let's get her back on and have a look uh you guys Oh, my cap's showing. Hang on. You can see I have kind of a larger head. A lot of these wigs don't fit me properly. So I'm hoping with a little bit of extra hair growth there, it'll just sort of camouflage in. I'm hoping. See? it. That's just, see? It's the way my hair grows. I can't do anything about it. I have issues. So let's get her. Okay, let me shift that back. You guys, look at this. <gasps> Holy moly. Oh, she's pretty. She's pretty. She's got a little hump going on right there. But that's easy to lay down. It does appear that she has some little bit of hair that's a little messed up right there. Um, but that looked to me like on the box it was intentionally messed up a little bit right there. So you can make baby hair out of it. This She doesn't come with baby hair that I can see anywhere. She's just your standard... unit. Okay, so if you know, uh, if you watched my Christmas um, time, I got this Milano stuff. I use this latte here. That's, and I need to find, I need to find more of that, just that color, because I don't feel like buying a whole entire um, palette just for one color in the future. So I'm gonna try my hardest to find a cream that matches that color because that's that's pretty close to my skin tone. It's just a little bit lighter to give it a little more realistic scalp looking appearance because your scalp is always just a little lighter than your skin on your forehead. Something happened. Yeah, see, it's pencil thin, razor thin. Like that is not, that you guys are gonna probably have to, I'm gonna have to go in there and pluck that out a little bit. I'm not gonna do a whole lot of plucking to it again, but a little bit of plucking is gonna be warranted there. And that's it. Yeah, see how this, because I have this stupid long, really short forehead, that actually looks 
not terrible. It's actually blending into my actual black hair pretty well. To be honest with you, right there, that, that looks pretty good. Uh, yeah, I'll have to, this, this is pluck, pluckable space. I'm going to go in there and pluck that, some of that out before I actually wear her. And I'm going to wash her and then, like, just press this down. And that's all I'm going to do to this one. Because she looks fantastic. Does she look like the stock card, though? With the exception that she's not the same color. Yep. Yeah. This side does. Let me get it out from under my ear. And this side does. You guys. Am I going to recommend this girl? Um, I, I'm going to wear her as soon as possible. I, I'm going to wear her somewhere. I don't know where. But it, it's going to be like as soon as possible. Okay. I think she's cute look and she's not going to take much work she's going to be a 10 minute 10 minute style tops because it's just really really just making this part this fluff this part needs to go down like that's poofy could also because she's in the box for a while you know she's an older style unit i believe she may not be i could be wrong but i'm gonna do uh the little here wait let me get that done tucked i'm gonna do the little spin here all right, so we have got Lanessa on the right side, my right side. Okay, I'm going to, don't look how dirty my mirror is. Okay, and this is Lanessa in the back. And there she is. On my left. Y'all, she is cute. I don't felt I didn't feel like I saw any tracks. I don't feel like there's anything wrong with her in the back. Her construction seems nice, except she's gonna have she's got some hard lace on her. So if if you don't like hard lace, if it if you're prone to itching or if you're prone to to breaking out from hard lace, because some people actually can get uh, like little bumps from hard lace um, because of their hair follicle, if that's gonna, that could be a deal breaker for you, okay? But if you can handle the hard lace or if you don't mind the hard lace, it doesn't really do anything nasty, I, I'm gonna say, go get her. I am completely happy with this girl. Again, I am gonna have to go in and pluck this a little bit but it's going to be a 10 minute 10 minute deal from start to finish plucking and 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 just sealing that part down a little bit right there um when i get some real hair and it'll kind of all blend together there it'll be nice i think yeah yeah she's gonna be cute I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of her. Let me get that the way I would probably. That's the way I actually would wear it. You guys. Lanessa. By Bobby Boss. She is in the color. Well, she is MLF312. And I have her in the color TT1BOLBRY. Go get this girl. All right, that is everything that I have for you guys today. Make sure that you stay tuned. I've got a surprise upload video coming out um, this week. I don't know what day. I'm editing it. It'll be out this week. I'm hoping to do more surprise uploads. Um, so you'll count on my Wednesday upload and then every once in a while I'll have a surprise upload uh, at another point during the week, okay? But so keep your eye out for that. Make sure um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel that you do subscribe and that you smash the notification bell. That way you're alerted when I do upload those surprise videos. Go ahead, please give me a, a like down there um, right under the video. It helps my channel a lot. Comment if there's a wig that you'd like me to see and other than that y'all have a really great week and I will see you later love you bye